When two or more intersecting or adjacent surfaces exist in a model, they can be merged into a quilt. Merging surfaces into a single quilt is sometimes required for operations such as creating solids from quilts. If we look at the merge tool without anything selected in the graphics area, we can see that it's grayed out and can't be selected. That's because we need to pre-select the surfaces that will be merged before starting the merge tool. So we'll press control and select both surface quilts, then go back and start the merge tool. If we open the options tab in the dashboard, we can see that the default merge option is intersect. This option is primarily used for intersecting quilts. Join is recommended for merging adjacent quilts when choosing a side to keep isn't required. If you'd like to perform a quick visual check to see which sides have been chosen to keep and remove, just click Preview. In the dashboard, you can toggle the Change First Quilt Side and Change Second Quilt Side buttons to change the size of the intersected quilt that will be kept after the merge is complete. You can also edit the sides to keep by clicking the direction arrows in the graphics area. Let's click Preview to make sure the correct size will be kept and then complete the feature. For our next example, we'll need to unhide these surfaces. and change the model display to be no hidden. See where there are purple or magenta edges? That's where each quilt is merged together. These are two-sided edges. The yellow edges are one-sided edges that have not been merged with another surface. A merge operation makes one-sided edges into connected two-sided edges. You'll notice that a round can't be added to an unconnected one-sided edge. However, it can be added to a two-sided edge. Because the surfaces that we have unhidden are adjacent to each other, they'll be joined together rather than intersected. Use the control key to select all of them before starting the merge tool. Notice that the operations tab is grayed out because none of the surfaces intersect. Creo Parametric will automatically join them. After the feature is completed, you'll see the joined edges highlighted in green. Unselect them and you can see that they're magenta, just like the other merged edges. Each surface is now part of a single surface quilt. The merge tool is the perfect tool when you need to quickly intersect or join surfaces into one single quilt.